All right, guys, so today we're going to be talking about technique on a corner post route here by Brandon Cooks. We're going to talk about how sudden you have to be with your feet and the mistakes that a lot of people make when they're working a double move route, okay? So I think the main thing we can focus on here is when he makes this break to the corner, right, besides committing his shoulders, besides committing his hips, right, and his DBs and man coverage trailing him, got him a lot of separation off the line of scrimmage. That's the part that we can't see here, but he's not reaching out for this break, right? When a lot of people make this break, right, they'll go here, then they'll go one, two, three, and they'll reach super long. They'll reach with this cut. They'll lean their chest back and the and then they'll drag this inside foot, right? Because that's how they use it to slow down, right? But you see Cooks here, he breaks, he goes one, two, three, and he's as sudden as he can, right? A little bit of head and shoulder movement. His upper half is violent, his upper half is quick, and his feet are as sudden as possible, right? Because when I come out here and I reach for this break and I reach out and I lean back, even if that does get the DB to bite inside, I'm still running slow and he's gonna be able to commit. So I gotta make sure that I'm quick, one, two, three, as sudden as I can, be violent with my upper half, and if I could get him to head hesitate while I'm sudden, while I keep my arms pumping, I keep a good pad level, I'm going to be able to get a lot of separation. It helps being fast as well. Let's watch it full speed again one more time. So pop, pop, quick feet, sudden feet, don't reach out, don't drag that.